Here we have the 2021 Chevrolet Trailblazer. And this one comes in the RS trim level with all wheel drive. And that beautiful color there is Oasis Blue. And the interior consists of jet black with red accent cloth. And your powertrains kind of consist of the upgraded 1.3 liter turbocharged three cylinder engine made it to a nine speed automatic transmission. And there's a front end there. You have your LED headlamps, daytime running lights. And then down here, you have your 18 inch aluminum wheels. Then you have passive keyless entry on the front two doors. Here are the controls for your power door locks, windows, and mirrors. You have a Bose sound system. The controls for your headlamps and fog lamps. And there is your power driver's seat with power lumbar support. And then this is a very small SUV, so I could probably fit in there, but I'm not gonna try and squeeze in there today. But I'm 6'3", and as you can see, that's who I have the seat adjusted for in the front. And then you have a USB, USB-C charging port, as well as a three-prong household plug-in down there. And I really like how they did that dual exhaust there. And as you can see, you also have your LED tail lamps. And plenty of space in the back as well. And if you want even more space, you just go over here, push this in, folds flat. And then just to show you how you let that up, just pull up on the seat until it locks back into place. And there's your passenger seat there. And I really like the red accents here. They look really nice. So now we're gonna take a look at that 1.3 liter. And there it is there. I'm gonna hop in the driver's seat here. And here you have a very nice leather wrapped steering wheel. And I like how they kind of did the flat bottom here to make it a bit more sporty. But over here, you have AM, FM, XM radio along with Bluetooth audio. There's your backup camera there. And you also have your wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. So just over your Bluetooth signal, you can go ahead and put your phone through and then you can convey whatever's on your screen, including your maps. So don't even need navigation because you can do it wirelessly. And you have single zone automatic climate controls. And you also have three-stage heated seats for the driver and passenger. And then down there you have your wireless charging pad, which is a pretty good size. Should fit about any phone. And then you have a USB-C, a USB, and then an aux input there. 
along with an SD card reader and a 12 volt. And then here you can toggle your lane keep assist, auto stop, traction control, your all wheel drive, and of course your sport mode. And here's your shifter, reverse, neutral drive, low, and then you can shift here. And there's your electronic parking brake. And I like how they did the center console storage here because it looks like you don't have a lot of space. You can put a phone or change here, but then you have all that space down there. So really good storage technique there. And there's a view of the rear seat from up here. And they have a little space to put somebody else's phone or small knickknacks or whatever for your passenger. And then you have your glove compartment here with your owner's manual. So over here you have your cruise control, which you can toggle that. It's also gonna be adaptive cruise control. And then you can set that there. You have your gap adjust. And then over here you have your Bluetooth controls as well as your gauge cluster controls. And behind the steering wheel on the left side you have your track list radio station toggle here. You can go through those. And then behind it on the right side you have your volume controls. But there's a close-up of the gauge cluster there. There's your push button start. And there's your key fob with remote start. So next it's time to take this 2021 Trailblazer RS all-wheel drive out on the road for a quick test drive. So surprisingly quick and the all wheel drive, you can feel how sticky it is just in terms of driving a front wheel drive trailblazer. So really impressive there. And I'm even gonna put the sport mode on. See if I can keep up with this Corvette. <laughs> Oh yeah. So the sport mode does just keep you high in the rev range there, but I really like it because that's where you can feel the turbo kick in in that sweet spot, like 3,000 to 4,000 RPMs. So I really like that. I have the adaptive cruise on now. And it's just so awesome that you get a car like this with adaptive cruise control on it. But I'm gonna take the sport mode off. And after this truck got from in front of me, it started to speed back up. And we're getting about 35 to 40 miles a gallon doing 71 on the interstate so really good and surprisingly this ride is pretty decent and I really like the how comfortable the seats are too even though they're cloth just really nice and I like how they did the fabric because that helps a lot too but a surprisingly tame driving ooh the brakes I love the brakes 
as soon as I hit the brake pedal, you feel them start sticking, but it doesn't throw you back or, you know, lurk you, anything like that. Just really nice and controlled. But this Trailblazer is surprisingly, like everything about it's been great so far. So I took the all wheel drive off. So now we're just driving in normal mode with the front wheels. I really like the steering wheel like I said that before but it's so it's got such grip to it it's easy to grip your hands around it and the steering feedback itself is pretty nice but it really just it feels so sporty it makes this car feel even sportier than it wants you to think it is And the ride down this back road, it is bumpy. I mean, you have 18 inch aluminum wheels, but the suspension does a great job at not making it uncomfortable. And this road is terrible. So even in the nicest Yukons and Escalades, the ride is a bit choppy, but really impressive from this Trailblazer here. And it just feels so good accelerating with this 1.3 liter three cylinder turbo engine. It's just crazy how quick it can get up. And really, I can't hear the engine at all. All I really hear is just the tires. Yeah, this has been fantastic. But this is going to bring me to an end of my review of the 2021 Chevrolet Trailblazer RS with all-wheel drive.